Hello, I'm at 508 Dill Point. It's Thursday, July 28th, 2022, and I'm going to be doing the interior part one of the interior move-in walkthrough today. So as we come up to the front door, there is a keypad provided at this property. I will give you the combination for the front door on my move-in report, so please take a look at that. Um, this house is looking really nice. It has been cleaned, uh, but with that said, there are some marks along some of the uh, trim and baseboards and windowsills here at the property, but again, nothing major. This whole house is looking very nice, and uh, the uh, living room right here is no exception. The walls look good. They might have a, um, they might have a few just little drywall inconsistencies present on the walls, but um, other than that, they are all good. No problems there. No damage. The front windows are okay. The left window does not twist open and close, but the right one does, and they both have screens. Again, definitely have some marks kind of on the trim over here, but nothing out of the ordinary. And the floors in here are looking good. There might be some slight wear around the edge, like maybe where a rug was put down. Um, got a couple little scratches right here in front of the window. But other than that, it's looking fine. No problems there, no large damage. Right over here in the dining room, and walls look real good. Again, there might be a few just kind of drywall inconsistencies present, but no large damage or marks, so that all looks fine. The back windows right here, they have screens, but no blinds or treatment. Again, they are showing just maybe some slight wear just from age and use. Uh, the left one has a few marks on the glass, and the window sills do have a few marks on them, all three window sills. And walls look really good. So the thermostat is gonna be right over there on the wall, as you can see. And the hanging light is working and operational. All looks good there. And the floor in here, just like the living room, showing a little bit of wear and tear. Um, nothing major. There might be a, uh, just a little bit of discoloration over there by the, uh, by the back door. But again, nothing out of the ordinary. Alright, as we come on over here to the kitchen. So the walls here in the kitchen look good. They are unmarked and undamaged. No problems there. The backsplash is also undamaged, all looking fine. There is maybe a, uh, there's a little tiny slight mark on the ceiling right there above the sink, but again, nothing out of the ordinary, all looking fine. Um, we will take a quick look here in the alcove area. So I was still calling this the kitchen. Uh, ceiling fan is working and operational. Walls and ceiling all look good. No problems there. The windows here are definitely showing a little bit of wear and tear from age and use. There are screens present, but no treatments. There are also just some marks kind of on the glass. That ceiling fan looks good. Back door right here has a screen door, but no treatments. Again, also may, uh, there's some a couple marks on the glass. And the floor here in this alcove area is looking very worn and torn. Uh, lots of wear present just from use. Uh, there are some multiple marks and scratches kind of present throughout. Over here by the counter, again, definitely lots of wear on the floor, so um, not a problem. Just wanted to note that down. No large damage, but there is definitely some wear and tear. The cabinets over here in the kitchen are looking good. They are unmarked and undamaged. Same thing with the countertops. Unmarked, undamaged. All looking fine. No problems there. Backsplash looks good. And right over here, we are gonna have some house items. So these are some house keys right here. So there is no front door key. There's just a combination, but all these keys, there's like a garage door key, a side door garage key, a back door key, a basement key. There's, there's keys for various other uh, doors, but nothing for the front door, just a combination there. And again, there's two garage door remotes provided. Please make sure you leave those when you vacate the property. I took a picture of all the closets and pantries on my move-in report, if you'd like to take a look at those there. And let's go ahead and take a look at the appliances, starting right here with the fridge. And fridge looks good. Unmarked, undamaged, no problems there. All looks fine. Interior, also looking good. Has been cleaned, all the shelves are working, all the pockets are working. All looks good there. Also, please note you can pull this little handle trigger right here to kind of do a fun little door open. Right here we have a, uh, a chilling drawer. Again, looks good, unmarked and undamaged. And down here is going to be the freezer. Also looks good, unmarked and undamaged. Right here is going to be the microwave and the oven. Microwave is right here on top. Unmarked, undamaged, all looking very good. Oven right down here, right below, also looks good. 
There's definitely some wear on the interior, just from use, just from previous use, lots of wear. But the exterior looks good, no problems there. Uh, right here's gonna be the sink, so hot water works. Garbage disposal works. All looks fine there. Got a strainer provided for the left-hand side. There's no garbage disposal on the left-hand side, so please don't put any food stuff down it. Um, there is just some slight wear kind of just around the drains right here and maybe around the edge where the sink meets the counter, but um, no problem, all looking fine. There are some house items under here for use. Feel free to use these. Dishwasher right here, again, unmarked and undamaged. All looking fine. And right here's gonna be the stove. All the burners are working, exhaust fan works. There is some wear on the stove top burners from previous use, but uh, other than that, that's all good. And the floor here in the kitchen, just like the little alcove area, is uh, definitely showing some wear and tear uh, from age and use. There's multiple marks and scratches and wear kind of present throughout. As you can see, pretty heavy right there, ring. Maybe a desk chair was probably there or something like that. So definitely showing some uh, just general wear and marks throughout, but no large damage. All right, right over here, uh, this is going to be the family room. Again, family room walls look good, unmarked and undamaged. Windows here have screens and blinds, all looking good. The far left blind does not twist, but all the others are, are, are working fine. So the fireplace is right here. Um, the mantle and hearth are showing a little bit of wear and tear just from age and use, but uh, no damage. All looks good. We have a TV mount with two brackets right over here on the wall. Please make sure you leave those brackets when you vacate the property. Ceiling fan is working and operational. All looking good there. And the floor here is definitely showing some wear and tear from age and use. Excuse me, age and use. There's uh, kind of some traffic marks present, as you can see right here. Just some general stains. Um, nothing major, just uh, some, some kind of general wear and tear. There's also some marks on the baseboards all the way around, like I mentioned earlier. That's going to be pretty standard for this property. All right, next, and as you can see, just another example. Lots of marks right here on this little thing. Again, pretty standard for the property. Right over here is going to be the laundry room. So, laundry room walls look good. There are a lot of cabinets here. They are all up and working, and both of the hook racks are also up and working, all looking good. There is kind of a big patch right here on the ceiling, as you can see. But again, cabinets look good. Right here, we're gonna have the utility sink. The utility sink is uh, ready to be used, showing a little bit of wear, but again, all pretty standard for the utility sink. And right here, we're gonna have the washer and dryer. So the washer is gonna be right here on the left. Unmarked and undamaged, so all looking fine. And uh, please make sure you leave the washing machine door open when not in use, just like that. And right here is going to be the dryer. Again, dryer is also unmarked and undamaged, all looking good. Filter is going to be right there in the front. No problems there. I said there is a big uh, patch on the ceiling right here. I think I mentioned that. I just want to make sure I got it. And the floor in here is um, definitely showing some wear and tear just from age and use. There are some marks present, but that's okay. Just like a mudroom floor. So no problems there, but definitely some wear and tear. All right, and finally, we're going to come on over to the, um, finally for part one, we're going to come on over to the half bathroom right here. Again, walls look good, unmarked and undamaged. Shelves are up and working. The window right here has screen blinds, all looking fine. The blind does not have a twist rod, but that's okay. You probably want to keep it closed because it's a half bathroom. Sink right here also looks good. Mirror lights all working. The exhaust fan does work. Back of the door looks good. No problems there. And the floor in here, um, again, showing maybe some slight wear and tear, but uh, nothing too out of the ordinary. All is fine there. All right, that'll be it for part one. We're going to go ahead and go on upstairs for part two. Thank you very much.